everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I've decided to film a get ready with me as I'm going to eat out to help out. This is the finished look so if you would like to see how I created this then keep watching. So I have already prepped my face just with the By Terry Cellular Rose Brightening CC Serum and this is in the colour Sunny Flash. So it just looks like this. I really like using this because it gives you a glow. I haven't done my fake tan in probably about a month now and that's very unusual for me because I'm always putting fake tan on but just scrubbing it off and it going patchy, I just started to dislike it and it was so much effort to scrub it off. I'm having a break from it but that is very good to pop on your face to make you look as if you have a sort of sun-kissed glow. So I'm going to start with my eyebrows like usual and I'm just using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Pomade in the colour Chocolate. So we have already done the help out, no, the eat out to help out a couple times already. We've been to Frank and Benny's and um, Prezzo. So tonight we've decided to go to Prezzo again, just because we like the food and a lot of places are actually um, fully booked because this is the last week they're doing it because it was just through um, August. So we decided to go one last time because 50% off is very good. Usually in Prezzo I go for um, an Arabiata pasta. So I think I might go for that again tonight, or if I'm feeling a bit unhealthy, I might go for a calzone. But we'll see when we get there. I think the look I'm going to go for is just a bronzy look, I think. Not nothing, nothing too out there, because it is a Tuesday night. And yeah, I don't know, just... Just something a bit natural, well, I wouldn't say natural, but more subtle. Recently I've been sitting down and trying to plan what videos I'm going to upload when, just so I can get into, I'd say a bit more of a routine, but I guess I'm in a routine by uploading and having a schedule, so really just to know what I'm going to upload and when and to make sure that I have enough video ideas for the rest of the year pretty much especially being back at work now I need to know sort of when I can film and everything like that so if you have any suggestions that you would like to see throughout the year whether it's autumn related videos, Christmas related videos, literally anything, I'd be happy to film. So that's my eyebrows done. For foundation today, I think I might go for my Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Foundation. Just because of what I can remember, this is quite pale and recently... I've reordered my NARS tinted moisturiser because that's what I usually wear and I ordered it in the same colour but for some reason it's very orange. So I don't know whether they've changed the colours slightly or whether it's, I don't know, just because it's a fresh bottle, who knows. But because I haven't got tan on I'm very pale so I need a very pale foundation. Also, I don't really wear this one that much, not enough, I don't think. And I don't know why, because whenever I put it on, I love it. So I definitely need to wear this one more. And it smells amazing as well. If you haven't ever smelt this, I don't know what it smells like, but it just smells very good. Yes, this is pale. I definitely need to get myself a new beauty blender as well because I like going over my foundation after I've applied it with a brush with a beauty blender 
just to get rid of any streaks that is on my face. Um, my beauty blender is disgusting and I mean disgusting. So I might do that off camera. I actually wasn't planning on filming this video. I don't know why, I just, I was about to do my makeup and thought, why not sit down and have a chat while doing it? So here we are. For my concealer, like always, I'm using my Lasting Perfection Collection Concealer. And this is in the colour Fair. So I'm just going to pop some of this under my eyes. And also on any spots or blemishes I have. I've actually broke quite a lot around my chin area at the moment. I think it is those horrible masks. Anyone else relate to me? So to set my base, I'm going to be using my MAC Studio Fix Powder. And this is in the colour NC15. So I'm just going to mainly set my concealer areas and then pretty much all over my face. So just everywhere really. I'm now just going to pop some eyebrow gel on and it is the Mega Clear, it's a mascara, it's a Mega Clear mascara from Wet n Wild although it's not very clear anymore. So I'm just going to run this through my eyebrows to hold them in place. For my bronzer I'm using the Kiko Bronzer in Gold Waves. So that is what that one looks like. I, th I swear whenever I swear whenever I sit down to film a makeup video, I get on the topics of TV programs and series, but me and my boyfriend have just finished watching The Walking Dead. It is amazing. If you haven't seen it, go see it. Um I loved it so much. Well, actually, we are... We've just finished Series 9. You can buy Series 10, but the last episode to Series 10 hasn't been released yet. So we think we might wait a little while, because I think it's getting released in October. So we might buy it in a couple weeks. But yeah, I'm very excited for that. I'm very sorry if this video seems rushed. I need to leave in 20 minutes and I should have started getting ready earlier so sorry about that. For my eyes I'm literally just going to dip into my bronzer so I'm literally just using my bronzer and I'm going to pop this into the crease just to deepen that up a little And I'm going to pop a little bit underneath as well. For my highlight, I'm going to be using my Becca Shimmering Skin Perfector in the colour Champagne Pop. This is very old and as you can see, I've only got what's left around the edges. So I need a new one of those as well. I swear I'm always running out of makeup. It's just, I don't know, I wish it all lasted forever and you didn't have to rebuy it. But that's not going to happen, is it? Bit on my lip, bit on my nose, bit on my other cheekbone. 
also going to use my little finger to pop some in the corner of my eye just for a little pop and the other eye as well and also just under my brow on the brow bone so as you may have noticed I've recently got my eyelash extensions back so I'm not going to be applying mascara on my top lashes today just using a spoolie I'm going to brush through them just to make them nice and straight I am going to pop a little bit of my Charlotte Tilbury Legendary Lashes Mascara on my bottom lashes. Just because obviously you don't have eyelash extensions on the bottom. wonder if you can get that. Lastly, I'm just going to pop some of my Fenty Beauty Gloss Balm Lip Gloss on my lips in the colour Fenty Glow. And this is the finished look. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Sorry if it was a bit of a shorter get ready with me. Um, I'm running late. So if you did enjoy, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next one.